Craig Frenchtown School District leaders are denying that they ignored reports a high school music teacher was sexually assaulting students. That statement contained in court documents filed this week sets the stage for what could end up as a trial in federal court. MTN's Eric Clements joins us in the studio now with more in this ongoing case. Eric. Jill, Dennis, school district attorneys made that statement in response to a lawsuit filed in U.S. District Court. That lawsuit filed in Missoula against the school district and Frenchtown Superintendent Randy Klein for the assaults attributed to teacher Troy Bashar. The suit claims the district didn't stop Basher from harassing and groping the anonymous student named in the suit even after she complained. But the district's attorneys say they did investigate reports back in 2015 that a student was feeling uncomfortable around Basher with an additional report last year. However, they say the defendants deny they failed to take measures to protect female students at Frenchtown High School, saying the assault claims are unsubstantiated. And they say there were no allegations against Basher as early as 2014 and deny multiple students reported uncomfortable or harassing behaviors from the teacher. The district also maintains its staff promptly and adequately investigated and responded to all allegations of harassment, bullying, and threats. And attorneys say the defendants lack sufficient knowledge and information about the student's distress and decision to leave the district, so they're also denying those allegations. However, the district does admit that Basher texted the student and others, played games with the girl on her smartphone, and friended her on the choir's Facebook page. The brief also addresses whether the student's name was shared on social media or bullied in the weeks after the case came under investigation by the sheriff's office when people were rallying to the teacher's defense. The district also admits Klein wrote a letter to the student's parents saying, quote, Mr. Basher did violate boundaries with your daughter, but said the district could not substantiate allegations of inappropriate sexual contract. The attorneys also say Klein sent a press release to the Missoulian, but claims it was the newspaper that decided to publish it as an opinion piece. No court hearings have been scheduled in the case yet. Jill? All right, Eric, thank you. Basher is also facing misdemeanor criminal charges in Missoula County.